writing skills that you're gonna that we can read. Okay, and then not only are you gonna complete this, but we also want one of you to do the safety briefing. I see what you're doing. Did you hear anything, you Ann? The school mark. So everyone hear me at so when you're, when you're all in agreement on everything that goes on here, someone elect someone to do the safety briefing for the group. Okay, so you stand up and say, do the safety briefing. Okay, so let me get you the, the trainings. is important, that we value safety. And then number two, you can get a message from them. You might learn something from them. So, um, but it's those little things that, that add up to really the, that global safety program that the department has. And I think that's where this also lends itself, because we're taking, we're, you know, we, we pay a lot of attention to safety on the fire ground for very good reason. We just need to do the same thing for, for training, and it just shows that. So that's a good point. Thank you. Okay, we're going to do a couple group exercises. You want a quick 10-minute break? And we'll get into a couple sure. groups. Sure. All right, let's do that. Come back at 35. You guys are doing, oh, Portable master stream, okay? I think everyone is familiar with those. And then you guys are doing hydraulic rescue equipment, okay? So you can read over that. Some are a little more in, uh, extensive than the others. <clears throat> and so. So, you know, participants will deploy portable master screen. Yeah, that's exactly. Yeah, that's what I mean. Sure, it's on the right track with it. Nice. Yeah, there you go. You, you choose well. It's a nice spring day. No rain. That's cool. It just gets you to think about. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's not 20 degrees or. Portable master stream. For defensive fire operations? <coughs> yeah, sure. sounds good. And then they want materials or equipment to use, so that's all right here. Also. Yeah, so that's pretty short and sweet. Uh, pumper with portable master stream monitor. So it's going to be the same box here. And then just put traffic cones and traffic control equipment. Oh, I did, and it went too fast. We're going, going strong. So. Just for the, in the sense that, right. in case you grab it, going to the yeah. fire. Yeah. <laughs> that'll get warm and everything. Yep. Good. Uh, uh, medical, medical surveillance. surveillance. So we'll have uh, EMS equipment on site. Yep. Yeah. Um, so these are going to be. And I don't know how specific. It says be specific, but AED, not protection. How do you guys feel about a hood? I, I'm okay with them not wearing a hood. I think if I was. Um, tech, we're not in a fire situation, right. and it can be pretty warm. Yeah, I, I would say it would be almost weather dependent. That's what I'm thinking, yeah. especially if yeah. it gets hotter or colder or yeah. whatever. But uh, I think so. Okay. Um, do you guys allow us to take this? We do. do we yes, we do. Care. Oh, you do. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. Sounds good. All right. I'll, I'll, I'll call you my way. Where are we right now? Fine. Physical hazards? Yep. Yeah. Uh, well, you definitely are dealing with hinge points also working from an elevated height. Do you guys have any, any questions? Or yes. Hazards. 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 Thank you. 
in for anything? Okay, for, Training description for let me see, for the guys doing the, the portable master stream, the but it's a, it's a training pad, it's a con concrete pad with two vehicles. SCD accomplished. <laughs> <laughs> Why is your phone different than mine? 